what's up today my fellow Madden soldiers what we're going to do right now I'm going to get straight to it is that I'm going to power a few players up one of them is going to be Darius Slay I got him ready for the auction block I want you guys to see it go ahead and buy this guy his 86 is pretty pricey considering it's an 86 but to me he's worth it I had him before my other account and he was a goon look at how much he's going for 31,000 it is what it is the only reason, just so you guys know, the only reason I bought him, I'm not saying for you guys to go out there and buy him and power him up, but the only reason I was able to, because I don't know what team you guys have or what your OVR, or what you're working with, so I'm not going to sit here and say follow my example, but the reason why I did it is because I already have his 93, He and he performs great, but now on top of that, I have his, his 93 card right here, which just makes it easier for me to go uh, back down and buy the other little pieces. And his next piece is just his 97, and I'm happy with that, which I'm not gonna get right now. But later on down down the run, it'll be it'll be worth getting. So I'm I'm alright with that. Do I have? I think I need a. Yeah, another person is gonna be a, my left tackle. I'm gonna get Munoz. Oh, wrong guy. I mean wrong thing. Yeah, I'm gonna get Munoz because. He's he came in later later on as a ultimate legend and so therefore I could power him like I think all the way up to like here you go see all the way up to like a 94 we'll find out right now whatever the case may be so it'll be worth it just to have him but we're not gonna power him up power him up that much right now we're gonna power him up to like a a 90 we'll power him up to a 90 see he can get up to a 95 before I have to get his other card which would be a 98 so that, that's cool right there it makes it easier for us so I'm gonna power them up to a 90. I'm gonna, well, I'm gonna go just quick sell these cards that I have. I just wanted to buy these guys real quick so before I continued on. Yeah, I'm gonna power them up to a 90 because if I want to get identifier on one of one of my linemen, to me I use it. It makes it use it's useful for me when I play online. But if he doesn't have it, that's really gonna break my heart. Because I'm gonna power this guy. I mean he's still cool. He's gonna be a good lineman, but this guy on the quick sell. We'll do these both together at the same time. Yeah. He still he'll still be a good lineman, but man, like that's the only reason why I'm right now pursuing it to get him. I wasn't get Jason Kelsey, but I looked at all his pieces. Like I told you guys before. You know, looking at the pieces. Oh, I gotta, hold on. And uh yeah. I'm looking at all his pieces and they're gonna be too expensive to get each and every piece. So I'm gonna hold off on powering up Jason Kelsey and see what other free safety I'm gonna get. I mean, uh, free safety, other center I'm gonna get. Here's another one. And then we gotta do Jason Peters because he's our left tackle. We're gonna quick sell him because we're gonna use that. We're gonna use this, whatever we get from here to power up Anthony Munoz. All right, so now, okay, well, this is looking kind of weird. I hate when it takes for it. Let me, let me back out. Yeah, let me just back out. Yeah, I don't like when it does that. It just, it just, it's irritating. I don't think anybody does tell you the truth, but. The first one we do is Anthony Munoz because he need, he needs to get out the way because this is one of the main reasons I got him. Then we'll go to Darius Slay and then we'll, we'll, the next one we're gonna do is Deion Sanders because right now for some reason I thought his 92 will get a uh, red can but it's not. You have to use a power up cards certain cards after that you're able to. Oh wow, yeah you are able to, but for some reason cards before that I now that I remember you 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 weren't able to so yeah we're just gonna have to go power them up it's fine because we're gonna power them up anyway I just wasn't oh yeah, there we goes identified yes sir so that makes it worth it we're here I'm happy to get this guy because I was able to get identify on him so I'm content with that but anyways yeah certain cards that came out afterwards they're able to get red kims without having to power them up but for some reason before that they weren't so it is what it is we'll go ahead and do Darius Slay you know what 
Yeah, I have, I have enough to do there to say. What am I tripping on? Because I was going to do Dion first just in case I didn't have enough. But, I mean, I still got coins up there if I, if I, don't, have, if I don't have enough. To go buy some. Because we are going to power them up. Yeah, I really like Darius Slay. I, I, don't, I don't know what it is, but he may not, for some reason, no matter what you're playing, who you're playing against, he may not be as fast. Especially the cards that have you, the card have you for before these, uh, his newer card came out. Like, he was, he was still a shut down corner. He was still shutting people down and making plays. So, stuff like that. I was like, man, if he's making plays with this, he got like 90 speed. While my other card, I think I got like 91. I could imagine with this upgraded card. So, I always wanted to get his newer card. So now he's gonna be up to a. Oh, he's gonna be up to a. I'm not gonna do the this one here, but I know that I have that ability once I get more training. So that's one something to look forward to before I have to get this one. So I'm happy with that. But right now we're gonna go ahead, put his team on him, put the schemes back on him, which is gonna be pricey too. But it is what it is. Oh, he actually has more. Huh? Oh, I'm gonna put tip drill. I'm not gonna all that pick specialist on it to me don't. Tip drill is, is just the same. It's going to read either pick specials or tip drill. Even if it's a tip, it's going to say the same thing. So, and it's cheaper. So, I only put pick specialists as if they allow me to put two Kims on them. Two red Kims. And if that's only one, then I'll just do it to make it look good. But otherwise, yeah. Here we go, Dion. And Chan Bailey, don't get me wrong. Chan Bailey, he, he's 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 doing this. He's doing this thing right now on, on the squad. But what I want to do too, because I don't want to see her make rash decisions, is that I want to leave room because you never know. EA might come out and be like, play these solos and win these free nap player. It might be a seat cornerback. It might be a it might be a, a mystery pack to where we end up with a cornerback. But whatever it is, I want to leave room for that because if it's going to be better than Champ Bailey or or a higher OVR. Then guess what? We're gonna go ahead and we're gonna go ahead and use that. So I want to I want to leave room for that. I don't want to see her make a rash decision. So it just it just makes it better to to make the to make it more interesting. I use all these teams, huh? I go find out what more I have later on. But right now we get the Cowboys. Cause if I have more of oh I think I do have more of the Cowboys. Yeah. What? Oh, cause he's not in the lineup, so he'll be the fifth one. That's right. Lockdown. But yeah, I always want to leave room. I always want to leave room. I should just put, I already put it. Anyways, I, I want to leave room for like, okay, well, if I get in another player, I don't want to feel like I have to get rid of them unless I just have a straight shut down corners that I was like, you know what? I don't even care who I get. But otherwise, yeah, I just want to leave it for now without having to continue. Because if I power up this guy right here, he's cool. But then make sure I end up getting that, like I said, for instance, I end up getting another cornerback that EA gives to us. That that's better, or higher higher OVR, and they can perform just the same. Then yeah, then I'll be like, man, I wasted my training for now. But yeah, I'm just gonna wait for now. So we got him now. Powered up. The next one we're gonna do, we're probably just gonna use training. Most likely, we're gonna use training on on the next one. I, I'm gonna have a if I don't have nothing to use a power up pass on the 94 to 95. Once we get there, then I then I'll use it on him. But most likely, I'm gonna find something to use it on. Because he's able to get training, and I don't wanna, I don't wanna have to use a pass on someone that I know we could use for training. So here's him. Oh, I gotta put Darius Slade back in too. I forgot because I powered him up. So yeah, this team is. Oh, look at that. <clears throat> Excuse me. We're at a 92 now. That what there is looking good. We 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 coming a long way. We coming a long. I'm I'm getting ex, I'm really getting excited about this team right here. We come a long way. So yeah, I'm just wow. So right now, like I said, I'm plotting ways to use the 92, 93 pass, 94, 95 pass. This scene, you know, I want to make to make sure I make the best decision once again. But one thing that to keep in mind, just so you guys know. Is that oh I gotta put the I didn't even put the left tackle in yet. Just so you guys know though, is that I'm thinking considering getting Calvin Johnson because once again, he's a card that I could power up to a 96 before I even have to put his other piece in. Another piece that I put in, which is his 98, will make him a 99. So I think that's something smart to consider. 
So I don't know, I don't know when I'm gonna do it, but that's one thing that I'm considering. And then once I do, I'll go ahead and bring the video and I'll go ahead and show you guys. But yeah, I think that would be a smart move. But like I said, I'm just waiting. And this Tate by Hilton, I was going to add his other card in there this week. I was going to buy it, but I was like, you know what? I'm going to get the Calvin Johnson first. I'm going to hold on to him because I'm because he's actually a real good card. But like once again, I want to at le least leave one card like room because I don't want to have to power him up or buy something. And then EA get, ends up giving us a good solid card that's a wide receiver. So I'm going to hold off for now to see if you know, if EA does give us one down the road. So I don't want to sit here and make a rash decision and then work on Calvin Johnson or something. So this is what I'm thinking right now. Like I'm just, I'm just putting my ideas out there because I'm still wondering what I'm going to do. I went to the auction block. I looked at a lot of players. So I'm just considering different ideas to, to make this team grow faster and at a good pace. So if you guys got any ideas, you know, let me know. Uh, whatever you say, I'll consider it. People are, you know, they're they're consider asking me for halfbacks. But remember, though, right now I'm not really gonna focus on halfback because I'm gonna get this guy up to a 97 once I'm fully level up to an 80. So and he'll go up to like a 98 OVR. So right now I I need to focus on other players that's gonna boost up our OVR on this team. So just consider that the best way to cost effective way to get a player to help build our OVR is a the decent player. That's what I'm focused on right now. Any suggestions for that? I'm open for it. The zone run right now, you can tell it's off. I'm going to go fix that up in a little bit because I know I have put some cards into where I didn't, I didn't put, add the chemistries. So I'm going to work on that in a minute. But anytime I add a new card, I'll let you guys know. Thank you guys all for tuning in. If you guys didn't sub, please sub to the channel. Hit the notification, notification bell to get notified each time that I post something. Until next time, man, I'm out.